Let's have a look how fast we reach near zero emissions while driving the demonstrator vehicle around in a city following a cold start. You see the emission control components mounted on the vehicle in light blue. We have an electric heated catalyst followed by a three-way catalyst, a gasoline particulate filter, a second three-way catalyst and an ammonia slip catalyst. NOx emissions and exhaust temperatures are shown above this at three sampling locations from the engine out position at the left to the tailpipe position at the right. All components are at the ambient temperature of around 20 degrees Celsius. Engine load and vehicle speed are at the top together with an indicator light for the ignition button. Indicator lights at the bottom show when heating measures are active. The ignition button is on as of the start of the recording, which happens now. But the engine has not yet been started. During these first seconds, preheating with EHC is active. The temperature starts to rise in the EHC. Especially now when the engine starts after 8 seconds and you can see an immediate increase in the exhaust temperature behind the electric heated catalyst. Look at the conversion of NOx emissions from the engine out value at the left to the tailpipe value at the right. We already have a significant conversion rate over the system from the first second we pulled away. This will continuously improve while the system is warming up. When reaching this traffic light, we are already reaching the point of near zero emissions, as you can see that at the NOx sampling point at the tailpipe. We will maintain this for all the rest of the driving, independent of the condition covered. So we showed it is really within 30 seconds or 150 meters of driving that we reach near zero emissions from the demonstrator vehicle.